If you're an insurance agent who wants to consistently write 100 policies per month, 100 policies month after month after month, then pay close attention to this video because what I'll do here is I'll break down the exact metrics that you need to measure on a daily, weekly, and monthly basis in order to write 100 policies per month. This subject we can talk about for a full hour if we wanted to. But what I want to do is break it down into a quick two minute training and show you the exact numbers so that you can start implementing that right away. So the first metric that you need to track and measure on a daily basis is how many calls you do. And you need to do 100 calls per day as a team. If you have two people working collectively, 100 calls. But what I suggest is that every team member place 100 calls because you can have individual team members writing 100 policies per month. I have quite a few team members who use my sales training that write 100 policies per month. And a lot of them, when they first get started, they make 100 calls and eventually that number goes down. But for starters, 100 calls will equate to 10 answers, meaning that you'll have 10 people answer the phone out of 100. So that's the first two metrics. Out of those 10 people, you'll have eight people who will let you quote them. If you follow my sales training, the six step script, the one call close, you should be able to have at least at the very minimum, eight people out of the 10 say, sure, give me a quote and you'll be able to get to the end of the call and ask for the sale. What I like to track is not just how many quotes the team members make, but specifically how many asks for the sale they do. Because you can quote someone and never ask for the sale. What's the point of quoting someone if you don't ask for the sale? So the specific metric that I like to measure is how many times your team members are asking for the sale. And that is eight per day. This right here is the most important metric of all of these that you need to measure on a daily, weekly, and monthly basis is how many times you're asking for the sale. And just so we're on the same page, if you ask the same prospect for the sale three times in one call, that's considered one ask, all right? So out of eight asks, you should be able to write two new households, get two new accounts. That's assuming that you close one out of four people. And again, if you're using this script, the six step script to one call close, and you're using the exact language that is written in here, then you should have a closing rate where you close one out of four people. If you're closing less than that, then you're not following the script. So two households is what you'll write on a daily basis, which equates to about five policies written. So when you bring on a new household, the husband and the wife, on average, new households have two and a half to three policies. And the way we define a policy or this particular presentation is if you have two cars and a home, that's three policies. Does that make sense? Okay. So to recap, 100 calls will equate to 10 answers, will, which will equate to eight asks for the sales. If you follow the script, you'll close two households which will equate to five policies per day. Now, there are five days in a week. If we just multiply that by five days, that's 25 policies for the week, which is 100 for the month. Now, this graph that I'm showing you has a lot of numbers. And what I want to do is just point out the most important metric that you need to measure. And I already said that that's the asks for the sale. You need to measure that on a daily, weekly, and monthly basis. The team members who I work with on a one-on-one -on -one basis, the every week when we have a coaching call, we review two numbers. And that is how many asks for the sale you did and how many households you wrote. If a team member does not hit their goal for asks for the sale, then I expect them to do at least 100 calls per, per day. So I want every person to do eight asks for the sale 
But if they fail to do that, then at the very minimum, they need to make sure that they have 100 calls per day. So writing 100 policies on a monthly basis is not difficult. It's simple math. You need to know your sales funnel and you need to have the right script that you use. So this six step script to the one call close is what I personally used to write 150 policies per month. That's 150 policies per month. And I have a few students who have surpassed my numbers and they also write 150 policies per month. And you can do the same if you have access to the script. So here's what I want you to do. If you want to write 100 policies per month using this script, then book a call. There's a link right below this video. Click on that, answer a few questions about your agency, and then you and I will get on the phone and I'll discuss and share with you exactly how this script works and how you can get access to it today. So this isn't for everybody. This is for agents who are really ambitious and who want to write 100 policies per month. So go ahead and click the link below this video, book a call with me, and I'll see you soon.